Hello, today we're going to look at a program called Tux Paint. Okay. There we see the Tux Paint splash screen and our friend Tux. Okay, here we see the tools, the brushes or the tool options, the colors, and our helpful little friend down the bottom here, Tux. So let's paint. There's my name. Let's switch to the text tool. Boom. There's my name again. And let's choose some shapes. Perhaps a pentagon. Pentagon has five sides with a different color. Red. Let's rotate it a little. There we go and draw some lines in a different color again boing there we go and some magic well let's fill the background with a different color again there we go and perhaps add some grass and draw a rainbow and another rainbow okay now let's uh, look at the stamp tool and we see a birdie up there it's an Adelaide Rosella let's add a little birdie over here and add a little birdie over there okay now what else do we have to choose from oh another it's a rainbow lorikeet Let's put one here to keep the other birdie company. There we go. And, ooh, a fishy. George the Blue Groper. There we go. And let's have a look. Ooh, a happy lion. And, ooh, kangaroo. We've got to have a kangaroo. And another kangaroo. Let's change the color again. Boing, boing, boing. Okay, let's have a look. Oh, some grapes. Let's have some grapes for the kangaroo. There we go. Okay, now let's uh, exit Tux Paint. Uh, yes. And yes. Okay. Now, Tux Paint is an open source bitmap graphics editor geared towards young children. It's an alternative to a similar commercial educational software product named KidPix. And we're reading this page from Wikipedia, the free encyclopedia. You can see the URL up the top there. Okay, there's an overview, some features, basic drawing tools, advanced drawing tools, parental and teacher controls. Okay, so there's some configuration options that have been added to allow parents and teachers to disable features and alter the behavior to better suit their children's or students' needs. So that's very useful. We also have a list of external links to provide more information. And that's about it. Happy learning!